Hi everyone, in this video I will introduce barrier options. Barrier options are exotic options whose payoff depends on whether the underlying hits a certain level, which we call the barrier, before the expiry date. These options can be either knock-in or knock-out. A knock-in option is not an option until the underlying asset reaches the barrier level. So if the barrier is never reached before the expiry date, the contract never exists. If the underlying asset price exceeds the barrier before, it becomes a vanilla option. A knockout option works as a normal option as long as the barrier is not reached. But if the barrier is reached before the expiry date, the option contract expires automatically. Barrier options can be up or down. They are up when the barrier is on the upside, while they are down when the barrier is on the downside. So there are eight variations of barrier options. Up and in, up and out, down and in, or down and out, call or put. An up and in call will start to exist if the underlying reaches the barrier before the option expires. If the price never reaches the barrier, it is as if the option never existed. An up and out call stays alive if the underlying stays below the barrier until the expiration of the option, while it ceases to exist if the underlying reaches the barrier before. The cost is reduced compared to standard vanilla options by using barrier options. They are always cheaper than standard options because of the barrier which activates or deactivates the optionality. Typically, an up and out call option is always cheaper than a similar call option without the barrier because it has a chance of being knocked out. Barrier options can be used to hedge a position. For example, a down and in put option will start to be a standard put and to protect against the downside risk if the underlying asset goes below the barrier level. Thank you for your time.